Um, it was obviously an, an assessment in that moment, and um, everybody was doing their jobs and doing their roles, and everybody was doing their job. Um, I was able to come back when it mattered most. Um, you know, everybody felt like I was ready to. Um, you know, everybody felt like I was ready to play. Um, you know, everybody felt like I was ready to play. Um, you know, everybody felt like I was ready to play. Um, you know, everybody felt like I was ready to play. Um, you know, everybody felt like I was ready to play. Um, you know, everybody felt like I was ready to play. Um, you know, everybody felt like I was ready to play. Um, you know, everybody felt like I was ready to play. Um, you know, everybody felt like I was ready to play. Um, you know, everybody felt like I was ready to play. Um, you know, everybody felt like I was ready to play. Um, you know, everybody felt like I was ready to play. Um, you know, everybody felt like I was ready to play. Um, you know, everybody felt like I was ready to play. Um, you know, everybody felt like I was ready to play. Um, you know, everybody felt like I was ready to play. Um, you know, everybody felt like I was ready to play. Um, you know, everybody felt like I was ready to play. Um, you know, you know, you know, just trying to uh, trying to keep fighting, keep fighting. How disappointed were you that uh, you weren't able to get touchdowns early and you had a couple field goals instead? Yeah, when you think about, um, you know, how important it is to start fast, and I feel like we started with good rhythm, good tempo, um, good execution for the most part, um, and we just kind of weren't able to connect and execute like we wanted to in the red zone. And, um, you know, when you're playing a good team like that, that 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 gets you. You know, everything, every little thing matters. So, uh, much credit to them and the way that they played today and how um, how they executed. Um, you know, I think for us, we just have to do a better job, um, better job of controlling the things we can, and, and um, playing cleaner. You know, they they played well and took advantage of the opportunities, and that's a really good football team. Um, really great great players, and and they. they you know, they, they did a great job today. After the last game, you said you didn't know quite how to feel. After this one, where are your feelings and where do you go from the game like this? Win, you know, find ways to win. That's always the mentality. That's always the approach, you know, and I think this is a moment where you, you go back and you, you reflect on it, you learn from it like every win, and, you know, you treat them all the same, you know, when you win or when you lose. It's about what can I learn from this? So... You know, the, the process remains the same in terms of how we respond and how we approach it. You just have to be um, self-critical, um, as we always are, um, and analyze everything as it's supposed to be and, and respond. Um, it's, it's, it's not a matter of winning or losing. It's just about playing to the standard, and we didn't play to the standard. Typically, when you play to the standard, you win. And I don't think we played to the standard and won yet. You know, we didn't play to the standard, and, and today we lost. Um, so it's a, it's a great team we played, and we have to uh, go back and reflect on it, learn from it, watch the film, and, and grow. That's five straight games now where you're <clears throat> behind at halftime. What are the, how difficult is it to keep you know, climbing out of a hole like that? It's about execution. It's about execution. Um, regardless of the situation in the game, um, Whatever it is, is about executing. You know, when we do that at a high level, we get that rhythm going. Um, <clears throat> we're complimenting, complimenting each other defensively, offensively. Covey doing a great job in the punt return game. The Gunners striking down their own punt. When we're playing complimentary football, we we're pretty darn good. And um, we just have to do that. We have to do more of that. And so that just takes great preparation. That takes, um, you know, being eager um, and having a growth mindset and wanting to learn. and. You know, everybody, everybody's, everybody's going to want to do that. Everybody needs to want to do that. Did you have um, on that fourth and two play? It was after you, you got hurt, um, and Nick decided to punt. This is about yet at the end of the third quarter. Were you involved in that discussion at that point, or were you because you had to deal with the whole the whole protocol thing? Um, I don't know that I was. I don't think I was. Um, you know, I don't know if we, you know, knew how far away we were from it. But, you know, in, in a game like that, you definitely want to – I mean, we, we're – you want to be aggressive, and we have been aggressive in the past. But, um, you know, we always support uh, whatever it's called is made in that situation. We just got to execute. You know, I, I don't even think we should have been in that situation, to be honest. So, you know, we learn from it and, and grow from it. Jalen, you mentioned the complimentary nature of football. Sometimes the offense picks up the defense, vice versa, special teams. In game – when do you feel being in that deficit, how things change in the moment? Um, you know, you have momentum in the game. There's always momentum swings, and I think whether there's momentum or not, it's just about how we execute. You know, that's what I lean on, and that's what this team leans on. And, you know, when you execute at a high level, you know, good things happen. And so I'm eager to, to watch the film and learn from it and 
um, assess it, and we, we, we have the opportunity to evaluate ourselves on that and learn from it as a football team. Fletch said this team cannot separate. What's your role in ensuring togetherness this week as you head into another uh, tough game on Sunday? Um, you know, it's, it's just, uh, you know, nothing changing in that process, keeping the main thing the main thing, staying true to that, staying true to who we are, and learning from it. You know, win, lose, or draw. It's always a deep, deep dive into what we can be better at, um, looking ourselves in the mirror and responding um, to, to the mistakes that we've made and also to the successes that we've had. And so it's no difference here. You know, it's about how we respond, um, how we are approaching it and how, how bad we want to grow, how bad we want to better ourselves. And so that's the mentality moving forward. And obviously um, that has to be done together as a unit. Let's take two more questions. Before you watch the film, in these hours before you watch the film, is there a, a play or a sequence that's, that's, that's really going to bother you? I mean, it's just execution. Um, you know, having the opportunity to, uh, I mean, you played the, in the first half, you know. Um, we, we preach trying to score in the red zone, and we've done a pretty good job of doing that in the past few games we've, we've made a big jump there but today we didn't we weren't able to um and it always helps scoring scoring touchdowns and we, we didn't do that enough game you had some chances to extend plays and I think there was a slip and then another sack later what were you seeing and what were some of the corrections in the middle of the game after those sequences um you know slipping I just I just slipped um I just slipped I was trying to Make a play, extend the play. Had an opportunity there, um, but that's that's kind of what it is. You know, some things happen. You know, we watch the film. I can't really speak on too much now, but when we watch the film, um, we will look at it and learn from it, and um, definitely take it with a growth mindset approach.